For seven years, South Africa has suffered under President Jacob Zuma. And it's material. 3.9 million South Africans have lost work in the term of office that Jacob Zuma has lived. So we can't continue to suffer under this one man. We are of the view that his term of office has been a blight on this country. And we should unite now and end it soon. For if we don't do it sooner, later may not come around. The Mulefe, who is clearly become uh, the, 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 you know, the squeezer of the, of the Guptas. <laughs> it's, it's the only way we could describe because it's in proper relations. See, this yes. guy phones them all the time. This is a squeezer. 44 times. <laughs> is, is that the, the, the complimentary term for a blesser? <laughs> the Guptas are the blessers yeah. in, this <laughs> in this instance. Um, it says the ANC is captured. You see? And I made this point before to say you can't say the Guptas in some ways have captured the state. You are better off saying the Guptas have captured the president. As I said yesterday in my remarks, you see, the Guptas are willing buyers. In Jacob Zuma, they found a willing seller. So they have captured Jacob Zuma in this regard. He, in turn, made it possible through multiple phone calls, telling people you will deviate funding to advertise in particular media houses. Telling people, in fact, and furthermore, the ANC is not, not involved in this process because there are sightings of what Gwedeman touches direction about which board members they want in particular boards. Even though the starting point is Jacob Zuma, let's not kid ourselves, the cancer of corruption has infused the ANC that its vital organs are dysfunctional.